Thing. Can I go get my Steph Curry jersey? <laughs> <laughs> Romaine Pacheco's watching the Warriors. So I'm sitting at my kitchen counter watching the game, going yay, Golden State, and the TV freezes. That frozen TV set everything else in motion. So I picked up this card, called the number. She says she called the number on her Comcast technician's business card, and Xfinity did a system reset. The TV's working, and I say, thank you. Of course, the game is over by now, and I don't know what the score is. Within moments, though, the score was the least of her worries. Her phone blew up with these notifications showing thousands of dollars in payments to Xfinity. This is my account on Xfinity. It ended up being $500,000. What did you think when you saw that? I can't say that on TV. She alerted her bank immediately, just in time. I scroll, every one of those payments had been attempted to pay, push through my bank account. God bless, be okay financial. They refuse payment on all of them. Xfinity's own website warns about recent scams targeting customers, saying be suspicious of anyone asking for personal information or payments. In this case, in a statement to Contact Denver 7, Xfinity says, we're sorry Ms. Pacheco was a victim of this phone scam. We've been in contact.